Hello everyone. This is the second part of this video series on how to build a WordPress website at local WAM server. And starting from this video, let's uh, let's start designing the real part of this web this, uh, web page website. And uh, in this header. Mostly in many of the yeah, traditional websites, headers are always on the top and the contents uh, comes uh, come below. But here in this website, there is this uh, banner or hero header at the top and here comes the header, uh, the navigation. Uh, menu logo at the bottom actually this uh, banner this image banner or hero header whatever you call is also part of this header let's design it and unsplash.com Anyway, let's look for yeah an image. Okay, let's use this one. Medium size. Okay. And then here, let's start designing. Let's create a new page. Let's call it home page. Page attribute uh, element of full white. Publish this. Let's edit it with Elementor. Okay. Uh, let's come back later. Now let's go back to dashboard. And in the setting, reading, is static page, home page, and home page, home page. Yeah, home page, page. Let's set this, the newly created page, as the home page of our yeah, one page website. Set the changes. And the next thing, yeah, let's create a menu, appearance, menus. Now let's create the menu. Let's call it main menu create menu okay and create links first what are the links here home let's call it home and then home like this okay next part about about Resume, resume, and then services, services, and then portfolio, portfolio, portfolio then contact okay then save this menu okay and go to header footer and blocks in appearance header footer and blocks and let's design the header add menu or oh, add new let's call it header and template header and this header is for entire website and uh, it is accessible for all users and let me 
the canvas publish it okay he did with elementor and then here let's create in one column section style background let's upload this the our downloaded image here and let's set it background and attachment size cover repeat no repeat attachment fix default position center center okay vertical alignment middle okay let's add some padding about 150 at the top sorry should be 150 at the top and 150 at the bottom like this yep actually we can set 200 hmm, like this and here hi I am allies whatever sense color to white and if you want let's increase the font size to at the yeah, let's okay let's and a duplicate font size 40 I am a web designer a little gray color okay like this and and a column like this and icon here like this arrow down on what double okay yeah this is the one color white link about link to about section and and on hover let's change the color to pink let's copy this color and let's give it here for future use and here like this and in trans animation shrink hang like this yep mm -hmm. a little space a little padding at the top of about 40 pixel like this hi I am Alice I'm a web designer okay if you want you can also increase a little padding about 250 at the top 250 at the bottom like this mm -hmm. it's better 
and let's design the navigation menu and the logo let's add new section add two column section like this and here okay um, side logo I have not uploaded any logo yet uh, yeah I have not any logo so let's delete this and use site title instead mm -hmm. Background of this section, white color of this logo, set to black. Okay, and then navigation menu. Alignment at the right. Yep. A little darker. And hover or active color. Let's use this color. Okay. Now that's it for now and in this section uh, let's in the section setting advanced stick header effects enable update it okay that's it for now now we have added Exit to dashboard and then click on website. Yep, this is the, our home page. Now we have added uh, our header like this. Yep, the thing is, yep, there is a little mistake. This uh, sticky header should come after yeah, scrolling this header banner image so uh, header boss and then sticky header setting in the advanced stick header effect scroll distance for yeah up to scroll distance to take effect for the header so uh, sticky header say Yep, 600 pixel. Okay, then let's try it now again. Okay, now if I scroll down like this, yeah, this is to get effect will text only effect when, uh, yeah, scrolling is. Uh, uh, 600 pixel of the web page has been scrolled up okay now i think yeah that's it for today that's it for this video and let's start designing the next part this about us section starting from the next video that's it for today we have already designed our this uh, header for this video and if you have any questions, thoughts, don't hesitate to leave a comment below. Yeah, um, this video series will have about uh, about 10 videos in this. And don't forget to watch all the videos to get a complete tutorial or complete guide on how to design this simple one-piece resume or personal website using wordpress and free elementor tools thanks for watching again have a nice day